I mean, it's no secret you grew up a Yankees fan. I imagine you dreamed of hitting home runs in, in the Bronx. Was reality as good as the dream? Yeah, it was a pretty special moment um, that I got to share with um, the rest of the guys and everyone. I think that's what made it super special. But, um, yeah, I, it, I don't think it really sunk in until maybe an inning or two later. What's going through your mind as you're rounding the bases there? Nothing. I was completely blacked out, everything about it. So Obviously not the end result you guys would have liked as a team, but what will you remember about hitting your first home run? I think kind of how it all happened and Judge you going back to back and I think I think too just how great of teammates that I'm fortunate enough to play with um, over the last couple of weeks. So many guys have had so many conversations about hitting and and different stuff like that where they're just so knowledgeable and experienced about the game that um, I mean even then just that at bat I, I call back to like yesterday I talked to Bader about a couple of things and today I talked with JD about um, some stuff I was working on, but um, just super fortunate to be on this team in this clubhouse with this group of guys. What What did they tell you? What were you working on that led to some success? Um, just, I, I mean, I'm, I'm lucky. I was with these guys throughout all the camp, and they've seen me when I'm going good and kind of when I'm a little bit off, so a different set of eyes, a set of eyes that I'm sharing lockers with and stuff like that definitely helps. You lead off two games now and two extra base hits. Uh, you're more comfortable, I guess, uh, leading off than the, the nine hole. You've done a lot in the past. Um, I think that's just baseball sometimes, how it works out. But, um, yeah, I want to play wherever I'm at in the lineup.